The Cal Mian campaign is really good because what it's done is it's not being judgmental, it's inclusive of everybody, and it's giving people goals and targets to really try and achieve. Um, something that we don't see often with HIV prevention campaigns. Um, most of them is sometimes around sort of waving stick up sort of what they perceive as bad behaviour. And this has kind of done away with all that. And it's really trying to get people on board, giving them goals, giving them something to look you know, forward to. Um, and so th by that I mean, it's quite innovative in the way that it's come forward. And getting people to really to stick to these five key aims is, is a great idea not assuming somebody's HIV status is key um, because we've got you know one in four gay men who don't know their HIV status so with those sorts of statistics um, we need to be able to ensure that people are, um, are taking care of themselves and not taking the risks you know continually. To people who are thinking about following the action points we would say great how can we help and I think that's where we come in once people can make those decisions we help people to keep those action points going things that we do here like around um, our HIV testing clinics, um, the mentoring and the counselling help to keep those links together, those five key action points around knowing your HIV status, about not assuming other people's HIV status, about being more knowledgeable, are all the sorts of things that are going to maintain a, a, a lifestyle where people are not taking the risks um, against becoming HIV positive. Um, something else I'd like to add is around Metro Centre being a partner in the CHAPS partnership um, with ourselves and GMFA, um, LGF, and you know the the partnership across the London. It's really good to see our programs that complement each other. So this campaign complements the sort of work that we do here, the holistic work that we do here, which complements other work that you know gets done in the country. Um, and those. Uh, the direct contract group and the other groups and the partnership that we have working together about getting this material out um, I suppose is what we're trying to do for the community trying to work together to a common goal really in reducing HIV